The burnt remains of bodies lie scattered through the town of Mechila, and the number of victims is expected to grow. It all started after a seemingly harmless argument on Wednesday over selling some jewellery to a gold shop, but that then led to a fight between a small group of Muslims and Buddhists. In the ensuing violence, a Buddhist monk was killed. Ever since, crowds of people have roamed the town attacking each other with knives and other weapons. Many homes and other buildings, including mosques, have been destroyed. Many people, Muslim and Buddhist, are leaving the town, and complaints are growing that the government's security forces are doing nothing to restore order. Some people in the town have told Al Jazeera they believe soldiers are making the problem worse. The army, they say, is trying to prove its importance after it gave way to a partially civilian government two and a half years ago. Last year, the same allegations were made against the military during violence in Rakhine State in western Myanmar. Entire villages were destroyed by fire and around 100,000 people forced into camps where they remain today. Most of them are Rohingya Muslims who are largely regarded as illegal immigrants in Myanmar. Back in Mechila, there are no Rohingya, but a small population of Muslims of Indian descent. The scenario, though, is the same. People killing each other and homes and places of worship destroyed. Wayne Hay, Al Jazeera, Bangkok.